All right. Back on dirt. Kokomo, so really short track racing. Um, just throwing in a set and seeing what we can do. And, uh, I mean, we're going to be slow. It's going to be a tougher split, as these usually are. And I haven't been racing dirt much, so as I stop racing something for a bit, then I get worse at it. So, um, yeah, we're the number 11. We've got 19 cars in here. And, uh, let's hop out on track and see what we got going on. Trying to feel the car out, figure out what it's going to want to do, what I need to change, if I can get anything hooked up. Not helping that we got someone on our outside. I'm just going to back off here so that we can go to the high side and now we can see what happens. right now, but uh, it's going to be hard for a lot of people to get clean laps in. Oh, that was way too early counter steer. And we were P10 by the end of that, so right about where we're supposed to be, let's refresh the paint schemes and uh, those load up as the cat yells in the hallway for no reason. Um, yeah, I'm not going to worry too much about qualifying. We're not going to take fuel out or anything. Uh, we're not going to get all that quick. And, uh, well, it's just going to be a bit of attrition, most likely, as it usually ends up in dirt. I hope not. I hope we just get 75 laps green and I go two laps down. But, uh, usually there's five or six people wrecked out by the middle of the race people throwing stupid slide jobs and uh, just being a little too aggressive and lane changing. Bad exit off of that. And we're 11th right now. Here's the flag. Out the of... Not out of 11, so that's good. Now we're 12th, 13th. But we didn't get beat by everyone, so... Now we're 14th. And we should be taking on over once the two-car finishes a lap. Get to racing three minutes early here. Awesome. All right. Everyone's ready to race. That's a good, good sight. Rylan, join Discord. Discord, Discord. Uh, no kids. Little kids and their squeaky voices. Oh, boy. All right. So, fuel-wise, I should be good. Uh, this is just School of Sim Racing preset that I tweaked minorly. 
and uh, D14. So, see what we can do. I mean, only three spots away from where we're supposed to finish, but we'll see what the quality of racing is. Then I got to remember to do the touring car series later tonight. So 75 laps, cautions on, and uh, well, if you go a lap down, you're just stuck there. Especially with double file restarts, you get sent to the back. So, the lap down is pretty much a death sentence for your race. And, uh, that's unless most of the field gets lapped, but if they get through half the field lapping, uh, most likely we'll be about two laps down then. So, hopefully, it's a good one. We are green. Not even gonna cut down because don't want to get into the end. The right. flag is out. They want you in single file. Pit road is closed. Well, we got a two X. Better than uh, just slamming into that. The guy in front of me was not ready, or the guy behind me was not ready to stop there. So. Three, car. Interesting start there. Someone got turned on entry, it looked like. And that just gave probably the back half of the field a 2x each. So. So we are going to line up back on the outside. We are much further up than we were. We got this three car who uh, is probably going to run us over, but let's try to get a lap in. Got a car coming out of the pits that stopped on track and. Already back under caution because of it, because he stopped to let everyone go. And isn't dirt so much fun. Okay. So, we're in ninth so far. We'll be starting on the inside this next time. Maybe. Closed. Pit road is closed. Unless uh, scoring is messed up or there's a lap car up ahead in this. No idea. We'll see. But we're on lap two so far. We got gridded One lap quickly. Line up on the inside. Not much else has happened. So to the inside, we're just going to go down low, hopefully avoid everything. Maybe we can do a full lap. So we'll be starting lap three here. And the leaders are turning down on each other on the start, and... Well. Let's just roll it down here. Stay far, far away from everyone else. I don't even care if I go all the way to the back. Just try not to get involved in everyone else's mess at the moment. Four car up in the wall. Got one flipping behind. And... Well, we're... In 8th, 
So, I guess that was the eighth place car that ended up flipping there. Pass that nine, car. Pass that nine, car. No, I don't know how he got involved in it, but or that was the A car. I don't know where the eighth place guy it's went. Road is so I went down there. I don't even want to know what was happening on our outside, but the guy that we were really close to running into off the corner, I think he was the one that flipped, so... Yeah, so he was the 8th place car. So, had we go. just got up by. in line... On the outside this time. Who knows what would have happened, but now we're up here, okay, so... Going green. We'll roll around, find out, and... Lots of the field has many incidents so far. Green flag, green flag. And give this guy room, the four's in the wall, and the yellow again. Fourteen's very lucky that I got on the brakes to let him up in there. So now we're in seventh. We do have time limits. There's still 40 minutes left in this race. But at this rate, I think half the field's gonna be kicked out for incidents. One left to green. You'll be lining up on the inside. We'll just do our thing again down here and uh, green. Stay focused. wait for the next person to be flipping along the wall. Definitely way over fueled now. Green, green, green. Looked the wrong way. Not doing too bad down here. It will go away once more people start moving down here, but right now, top side is still a little quicker as it will be. We've lost one spot. Probably gonna lose another here and then. That's going to be about it. But it's pointless right now to go up top. I mean, all I'll be doing is just running behind a couple other people. Three's trying to get all his spots back. We can probably come up now in front of the nine. He's the last car. So let's see if we can run up here any faster than I was on the bottom. Nope, we're in the wall instantly. Fourteen into the wall, seventeen into them. Reed's gonna go for the pass. We're just gonna run a little lower down, just to avoid the wall. Because I have a hard time getting out of four without hitting the wall, since the fenders don't bend in. The guy behind just plowing through. That costs them a bunch. You have a guy rolling the bottom that was down there with us. Uh, 
Trying to explore around, see what we got. Us. He's just quicker on the bottom right now. But we are in ninth place, so not too big of a deal. And we got another one down there, the 13. Kind of in no man's land right now. And the leader is coming. I'm running better laps down here now. Have someone to gauge my entrance speed off of. Coming out of the pits. It was going to. The yellow flag is out. Line up, single file. Pit road is closed. <sighs> Left up, four. Carbide, you had the position when the yellow flag came out. What a fucking four. joke. Carbide, you had the position when the yellow flag came out. Literally not racing anyone, just came out of the pits under green in a dirt race. What an absolute idiot. Well, let's hope we're not a lap down. What a absolute idiot. Literally no reason for him to be there. Pasta 12, car one to go. Next time by, you'll be lining up on the inside. Catch up 13, car. Get ready, going green. Hang on, we're not going green, not going green. Hang on, we're not going green, not going green. Pit road is closed. I have one no idea what's going on Catch with the lineup. Well, a bunch of people just got penalties because that was weird. Why were they getting sent to the back? No idea, but there shouldn't have been a caution anyways. But a lap car decided to plow into a lead lap guy. Good news is we're still on the lead lap and last car on the lead lap. So I'll get ahead of all of these lap down cars and... Then we'll get racing again. I'm just going to pass him now because it's going to save us time. Alright, well we're in 11th. We've got four incidents. We've been upside down twice now. I think we rolled it twice. And, uh, One to go. Next time by, you're I wouldn't expect time. anything Get less four, from dirt racing on iRacing. Definitely a bit of, uh, wheel damage on the right front or something. It's a little off. Green, green, green. Something odd in the steering, so... Thirteen 
Get under this guy, get back in rhythm. Oh, that didn't work out. Tried to get on the brakes to rotate it, and it just pushed the nose. Yeah, it's getting too slick down there on the bottom. Flip again. That one's on me though. Line up single file. Pit road is closed. Left up 16 carbide. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. Pit road is now open. Left up 16 carbide. Okay, field to go. Oh my god, dude. Catch up 14 car. Literally sitting there. All right, well, that's on me. Third flip. Now we're up to 8x because that guy ran into us. We're nearly disqualified. And it's lap 37. Well, we avoided that. Just. Otherwise, it would have been 10 incidents. Somehow we're in 10th, because most of the field's a lap down. And, uh... Just... Yeah. I, I don't know what to say. Tons of fun. Pit road is closed right now. Car is definitely messed up, though. There's something wrong with the steering that's... I don't know if it's in the rear or the front, but it's just not wanting to turn in like it had been. One left to green. You'll be lining up on the inside. Get ready, going green. Green, green, green. They are four wide in front of us. That's pretty impressive. I have to remember that lap 38. 18 is going to run into us even though there's no possible place for us to go. And now he's going to dive it into our inside. This is the same guy that ran into us under caution. He's got big brains. No, oh, we were ahead of the six for a second. I think we're still three wide. Six screwed up there. Making the middle work fine.
We are in seventh. Got this middle line fairly hooked up now. And, of course, the five just turns down and wrecks. And now we're up to ten incidents. Dude's running the high side the whole time. We get to his inside, he just turns down. I can't even react to that, like, can't even see the guy, he just turns in and wrecks himself. So, we're gonna get disqualified soon, and, uh, well, that'll be dirt racing. One left to green, you're on the outside this time. Get ready, going green. Got that middle hooked up pretty good, but nothing we can do when they just turn down and wreck. Green flag, green flag. So, one screw up and we're done. we finish this, I'll be amazed. There is someone else getting DQ'd, and, well, we are just swerving for our lives right now. Had I hit either one of those cars, we would have been done. And it looks like we're in fourth now. If we get DQ'd, we'll end up in 13th or 14th. Maybe 12th if we're lucky. One left to green. Line up on the outside. But we still got 27 laps to go. Get ready. Going green. so that we didn't get hit because we are not allowed to race now. And then we'll just have to avoid his next wreck. Space behind. I just need this guy to go the hell away. Like, if you're such a badass, go. But all you're doing is winding the engine up on the high side in the slick and making lots of noise. 
just want to get to the end. But still, like, 18 laps left, so... And sadly, we are in sixth place. I mean, that is pathetic. Upside down, multiple times. Run in six. But we could get a little higher too if uh, we have anyone else get incidents. Gotta watch out for the 12 car though. He likes to race people that he's not racing. These three are about to get together. But I could go a little quicker, but there's no point in it. We're pulling away from the 14 behind, and if I get close to anyone and get an incident, then we're out. So, another reason why incident limit is absolutely stupid. Let me rack up 50 incidents and get demoted. That's how it used to be. Now this incident limit pretty much prevents people from getting demoted. Well, do we try to pass the 13? We got 10 laps left. I can get up to him. He's putting a solid run down around the bottom. risky, but he was starting to slide up into our lane, so we'll just try to go lower. made it to this point. One bump from him though and he gets the spot and we get DQ'd. And it looks like we're going to get it passed. Or he got us right at the line. He got us right at the line. Nope. He got DQ'd. How close was this at the line? Not that we're going to be able to tell where the line was, but I was in the slick. And... Yep, he's just ahead of us. But he must have had a penalty, and so that pass didn't even really matter. Uh, because he ends up... One lap down in seventh.
And we are the last car on the lead lap in fifth. So everyone questions, why have you stopped doing dirt racing? I, I, I mean, we had to run the last 25 laps like our car was made of glass. We couldn't get near anyone or otherwise we'd get DQ'd. Not, not very fun. Uh, plus, being able to come out of the pits during green should not be allowed. Um, because that was stupid. So, yeah, we need some better damage models and we need some better rules. But let's look at the first incident that got us 2x. And it's a setup shop guy, the same one that ran into us under caution. And, well, apparently Jesus took the wheel there and didn't know where the brakes were. Here we go again. And what happened this time? Nine drags the wall. I don't know what the hell he's got going on with this setup. And the 12 hits the wall, and, well, we can't say much because we did the same thing, just didn't get stuck upside down. And Jesus is taking the wheel again. And the 4 puts himself in the wall, but then gets an assist. The 9 runs into the wall again. And the 10 slides up, but prediction code. And the 7 runs into the 18. And the 5 into the wall, and the 5 up the wall, and the 5 down. And the 1 car dragging the wall. 18 in the wall. 18 in the wall, 18 in the wall, 18 in the wall. Three car into the wall. Just gonna be a lot of wall hits until I get flipped. 14 up in the wall, 17 into him, down into the three. And the 10 into the 9, and the 9 into the 10, and the 9 into the wall. And I just, what the fuck is this guy doing? Like, comes out under green. We pass him, he guns it up, and flips us. And I just sit here, we get ran into over and over, got us going the right way, luckily we don't lose a lap, but, I mean, <sighs> no one behind us. No one behind us. But he's got to come out and instantly, instantly race. As he is 21 laps down, whatever it might have been at that point. I just, I went down low because we were ahead of him and he just came out of the pits. His race was clearly over, but not quite because he had to screw us over. So, that is two flips there. I don't know what those guys are doing. Nine's in the wall, 14's up the wall. And the 17's driving through the 10. 14's in the wall again. And here's my flip.
So we sit here, see that an opening's coming, stop, wait, stop again, and of course set up shop guy. Not able to see us or just trying to run into us to give us incidents. Barely miss that mess. One car's in the wall. And the one car's in the wall. Of course he wins, because slamming into the wall like that is the quick way. And the nine runs into the wall. And here's where the five decides to turn down. For no reason. He's been up top. But he hit the wall, we got to his inside, and I've been running this line the whole time. The car that's inside of him is running that line. And he just turns down. Like, there's nothing I can do here. He just turns down across our nose. But, uh, that was his choice, I guess. Or he didn't know we were there. into the wall. No, oh, wait, the one didn't win. He got DQ'd there. I forgot that this standing thing's changed, and now the four is just spinning around, trying to get everyone he can. Two in the wall. Twelve into the wall. And is it over with, or is this guy just calling it quits? It's over with. So there you go. Dirt racing on iRacing. Uh, I, don't, I, I don't know what to say. Somehow we made it to the end. Let's take a look here. Lose 0.3 safety rating. I'd be fine losing 0.8 safety rating if it just allowed us to rack up as many incidents as we can. Uh, because then the people that are very bad won't get stopped. Like, the people that got DQ'd, only half a point. I mean, let them rack up 40 incidents. Because they're not going to be in the class very long. And then they'll learn a little bit. Because... Having an incident limit is not preventing anyone from wrecking into someone else or not driving stupid. All it's doing is making, like, it may do its job in getting rid of someone that's wrecking a lot, but it's also getting rid of people that are just getting caught up in stupid crap. Now, I know a lot of my incidents were my fault, but the incident limit is just absolutely stupid because they say... Well, don't worry about this. It's a no-fault system. Yet, you're getting DQ'd for a no-fault system. It's just stupid. But we get fifth in all the stupidity. So, I hope you enjoyed it. Whatever you could there. And uh, one day, I will get them to remove the incident limit for everything above C-Class. That way, people can be demoted all the way back to D and uh, then learn their lessons again as they try to get back up this ladder. Thanks for watching.